Why do you still care about that boy? He has all but deserted you for the Keyblade and his new companions, after all. I don't care about him. I was just messing with him a little. Oh, really? Of course you do. Hello all and welcome back to Mistledyne Online and the walkthrough of Proud Mode Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 Remix on the PlayStation 3. Thank you guys for joining us. Last time we discovered a whole lot of things going on and we were able to finish up Agrabah and defeat the evil Jafar who turned into a giant genie and we beat in less than three minutes. I don't know what happened. I don't know why that was so easy. It made me sad. Anyways, the next place we're going to go to is you're going to set your destination right here for the battle level 5 star world. Not this one. You want to go to this one. And normal drive. And just like anything else, just focus on defeating the enemies that show up and getting all of the points. And of course, I will cut this out. Eventually, you'll get to a point when you'll see things and they'll disappear. And then guess what happens? What is that? Wow, it's huge! Looks like a whale! A space whale! Whoa! It's a giant whale! Thanks, Goofy. We, we're aware of that. It's Monstro! He's a whale of a whale and vicious besides! Oh, Sora, get us out of here! Uh-oh. So, on our way to our battle uh, battle level 5 world, we are eaten by Monstro. Now, you may remember Monstro from such films as Pinocchio. True, I saw it with my own eyes. Are you sure you didn't just hear it this time? What difference does it make? There's a huge monster in there, I tell ya. Alright, suppose there really is a monster. Think we can beat it by ourselves, Sora? No problem, let's do it! Listen, there, can you hear it growling? window or maybe a door it won't open jeez is that really all that's in here what do you expect in a boring place like this hey Sora hmm when we grow up let's get off this island we'll go on real adventures not this kid stuff Sure, but isn't there anything fun to do now? Hey, you know the new girl at the mayor's house? Did you hear? I wonder who the new girl would be. It's Kyrie. Hey, Sora. Are you okay? What are you guys doing? Where are we anyway? Whoa! Oh, you know, I think that big old whale monstro just swallowed us. And for today's weather, expect showers. Oh, heavy showers. Hey, who's there? Pinocchio. It's me. Oh, it's just Pinocchio. Pinocchio. Pinocchio? Pinocchio, where are you going? Pinocchio! Pinocchio! Come on, everybody! After him! Quick! Monstro! 
Now this is a short little world, but that doesn't mean that it's not annoying. <laughs> okay, so the first things first. First things first, let's just go all the way across here. Don't worry about any of the items yet. Just go to this ship and talk to Pinocchio and... What have you got there, Pinocchio? With this, we can get out of here, Father. Really? With this big block? You think so? It's true. So, how did you end up here, Pinocchio? Oh my, so the whale swallowed all of you too? My goodness! Yeah, looks like it. My name is Geppetto. I'm Pinocchio's father. When we got separated, I traveled all over looking for him. Thank goodness we're together again. So, you seem to know Pinocchio quite well. I hope he was a good boy in my absence. Well, we've all had quite a journey. Right, Pinocchio? Pinocchio! Hmm. That's probably not good. So you can talk to Geppetto if you so wish. I've warned him not to wander off here. He can be a naughty boy. Even so, he's very precious to me. And look at this. A save point. Now from here, you just want to focus on finding Pinocchio. It's not a big deal, but let's just go and see what's going on. So go into chamber one, because obviously he followed Riku. And just continue forward. What are you doing? Come on, let's go back. You know, Geppetto's awfully worried about you. Pinocchio, stop fooling around. This is no time for games. But Sora, I thought you liked games. Or are you too cool to play them now that you have the Keyblade? Riku? What are you doing here? Just playing with Pinocchio. You know what I mean. What about Kairi? Did you find her? Maybe. Catch us, and maybe I'll tell you what I know. Oh, come on! So the trouble with this area is these new type of enemies called Search Ghosts. These guys are annoying and their whole job will be just to knock you off of platforms. That is literally all they are there for. The Heartless in this area are not difficult by any means. They are literally just designed to stop you from going further into Monstro by knocking you off of ledges and cliffs and what have you. So you can come up here if you want, but we're not actually going to Chamber 2 yet, so don't worry too much about it. Just defeat these enemies. And they drop bright gems, which is awesome. And continue into Chamber 3. Now once in here, you actually have to defeat all of the enemies. Now from here, you want to just go and open this chest in the back here, which will be a Mega Ether. Once you have that, you want to return back to Chamber 1, and we're actually going to go into Chamber 2. Something I'll mention is that you can also, if you are at the same thing and you pick the shield and stuff, you probably would have Leaf Bracer by now. We got it in the fight with Jafar at the end when we leveled up. So, we can see what that does, and I'll show you that in a second. So if we go into abilities, we can go to Sora, and we can see that he has Leaf Bracer now, and Lucky Strike, which still isn't equipped. Why isn't Lucky Strike equipped? So we'll unequip Berserk, and we'll see that Leaf Bracer stops enemies from breaking the Cure ability on self. We don't actually need that right now, especially since we don't have that much AP, and everything else that we have is much more needed, I would say. Uh, and we can also see that... Um, Goofy has evolution, which is give up MP to give 30 HP to entire party. That's actually a new ability introduced with Final Mix, and it's a pretty powerful one, too. I would suggest equipping that. So, let's continue on. Now, I actually forgot to do something else, which I suggest that we do, and that is to equip... Uh, or, I believe we already equipped Donald with the Ray of Light, but if you haven't yet, make sure you do that. And into Chamber 2. 
Once you get into chamber two, just defeat all of the Heartless in the area because there are chests that you need to open. These air soldiers tend to be an issue. As you can see, a lot of the enemies here are flying enemies that will lure you out to areas where if you go to attack them, they'll knock you off. And once all the enemies are clear, you can open this up for a cottage. And at this point, we want to continue into Chamber 3 again. And you need to be careful in this area, be again, because of the knocking you off thing. Like, as you can see, they almost did that to us just now. And you want to be careful not to destroy these barrels. You actually need these barrels. Now, from here, we need to use one of these. We actually want to throw it about right here. And we can jump up here and grab onto this and use this chest, which will be Dalmatians 55, 56, and 57 returned home. Now from here we want to jump back down and return to Chamber 2. This will drop you here, and again you want to be careful not to fall off. And you will also be introduced to these new enemies, which are barrel spiders. Different, of course, from the pot spiders that we fought previously. These tend to be a little more tankier and will also self-destruct a little more often. Now, from here, we actually want to jump onto this platform right here. Let's see if we can do it. And we were able to do it. And now we need to jump onto that platform right there. And here we will get a Mega Elixir. Now from here, you want to jump on these barrels. And jump back to the ledge. Ow. So back on this ledge, where we were with the Mega Elixir and we were able to jump across, or not. We want to go back and go into here, which is Chamber 5. And of course, we will be surrounded by Heartless, which we need to... And continue into Chamber 6. Now, this is going to be a l rather large chamber. And you need to be careful not to break all of the barrels, because there are some barrels that we will need in this area. And then from here, we want to actually just drop down here. And then go into chamber three. And we'll find a red chest in here. And then open this chest once all the enemies are defeated and you will get an Osmos G. And then from here, you want to jump on this barrel turn around and jump on this platform which will give you a Meteor G or a Flare G, I'm sorry and then from there you can look around and see, oh what a pretty place and from here we actually want to return to Chamber 6 now you actually need to return to Chamber 6 from Chamber 3 uh, you need to actually like continue on so you actually can't like jump across here and you gotta go all the way through basically all of the chambers the same way that you went to get back to chamber six. Which to do so, I would suggest just ignoring the enemies. Then once you're back in chamber six, you can worry about these enemies later, but you actually wanna go all the way down towards this chest in the bottom here because this chest actually has Dalmatians, which are what we need. And open this chest and you will get Dalmatians 76, 77, and 78 returned home. Now we need to actually head all the way back up to the very top of the Chamber 6. 
And again, be careful not to break many barrels. We still need some. And from the top here, you want to actually grab this barrel, and you want to throw it over here, although it doesn't matter because I... Th oh, that is a barrel spider. That's what I thought. I was about to say, wait, there's an extra barrel. So we want to jump up here and jump onto this platform, and we want to open this chest, which will be a torn page. Another one from Merlin's book. Now, you'll see this across the way, but you can't actually reach that yet, even with a long jump. You just can't get there, so that's okay. So from here, you want to head down to the lowest area where we opened the Dalmatian chest, and you want to go into Chamber 5, and this will put you in a new area of Chamber 5. Defeat all of the enemies here, because there is a Trinity Mark and a chest that we need. And you may notice that the shadows have actually got a little tougher, a little more health, and they also look, appear to be a little bigger than they usually are, and they also give more experience points upon death. Are Heartless getting stronger? Once all of the Heartless are destroyed, open the chest to get a Thundaga G, and then you want to open this chest to get a Mega Aether. And then, of course, we're going to use the Blue Trinity Mark. For a bunch of money, and I believe a cottage. So much monies. Yep, a cottage. Great. And now what we need to do is we need to use this barrel. And jump up here. Of course, some of these are going to be barrel spiders, so make sure that you save some of those chests. Whoa, whoa, knocked us into chamber four. Great. Why do you still care about that boy? He has all but deserted you for the Keyblade and his new companions, after all. I don't care about him. I was just messing with him a little. Oh, really? Of course you were. Beware the darkness in your heart. The heartless prey upon it. Mind your own business. Maleficent is everywhere, man. Pinocchio! Riku! What's the matter with you? What are you thinking? Don't you realize what you're doing? I was about to ask you the same thing, Sora. You only seem interested in running around and showing off that Keyblade these days. Do you even want to save Kyrie? I do. <laughs> Looks like Pinocchio's in trouble. So, because we were actually uh, forced to go into Chamber 4, go. or Chamber. yeah, 4. Go back into Chamber 5. Clear some of these enemies out of the way, because we still need some items that are here. Now we need to grab this barrel once the enemies are gone, and we actually need to toss it around right there. That should be not a good spot. There we go, that's probably better. Let's get it as close as we can to the edge here. Once you have this barrel in position, you want to jump across and grab this chest, which is a mithril. And of course you can hop up here, and hop up here. Defeat these enemies. Break that barrel, and then you can open this chest to get puppies 79, 80, and 81 returned home. From here, we want to head back across these platforms and back to where we jumped in the first place, and back into Chamber 4. And there you have it. Next time, we will finish up Monstro and see where Pinocchio went and what Riku is up to. That's pretty much it for this episode. We've cleared most of Monstro, and you'll notice that we've missed a lot of items, and that's because we're about to get a new ability that I think you guys will enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys watch the next episode, and remember, never give up. Never surrender.